Hi, my name is Mike Dillard and I'm the creator of Magnetic Sponsoring. I wanted to put together this video series for you in order to offer some of my experiences and lessons learned that have allowed me to basically go from very humble beginnings to a seven-figure income in less than two years. Now there's a lot of information that we're going to cover, but all of it is centered on the fact that in my opinion the rules have changed. Really the old school, old-fashioned methods of pounding the phones, holding meetings, Pitching your business to leads and trying to turn your friends and family members into business partners have, for the most part, come to an end. Now, prospecting for business, as you've known it, has really become obsolete. It's an irrelevant, old-school sales technology that's really only pursued by individuals who have yet to discover the methods magnetic sponsoring is based upon. Now, I'd like you to stop for a moment and think and compare today's social environment to the world we lived in just 15 years ago. Really today, people are just drowning under a flood of information, marketing noise, and endless options to choose from thanks to the internet. Now, corporations have literally turned us into numbers. They've tracked our personal buying habits. They categorize our topics of interest. They constantly use that information to drive as many customized offers into our viewing screen as they possibly can. And there's entire industries, products, and pieces of legislature that have even been created just to help consumers manage this tidal wave. And you can probably think of pop-up blockers, spyware protection, spam filters, and the do not call list as just a few examples. Uh, basically, people have been forced to build fortified walls around themselves and their homes to fight back this onslaught of people trying to get their hands into their pocketbooks. I'm sure you know how that feels. Uh, solicitations are detested. Yeah, they're met with frustration and impatience these days. I know I feel that way when I get constant solicitations on a daily basis in my inbox. And we simply don't want to be bothered, which means no sane person would willingly build any kind of business based on these old school prospecting and in-your-face selling methodologies. Yet, the internet has created an entirely new world of opportunity for everyone, where you can literally reinvent your life and turn a very simple thought into an entire business for little or no money at all. Now, obviously, this is a trend you intend to take advantage of or you wouldn't be here right now. But unfortunately, 95% of those who start a home business will fail themselves, and the primary reason for that failure is that they didn't go out and acquire the knowledge and skills necessary to succeed in today's modern, very competitive marketplace. So with that in mind, allow me to pass on a few very valuable lessons that I've learned over the last few years that have helped me out tremendously. As far as I'm concerned, the key to success in today's marketplace is this. If you're going to sell something to someone, you've got to find a way to get invited into their world as a welcome guest instead of a pest. Now you really have two options when it comes to building your business. You can simply play the numbers game and contact enough people until you make a sale through the traditional old school prospecting methods. And this is the path that 95% of home business owners are going to take. Or you can position yourself in the marketplace in a manner that allows interested prospects to find you and contact you. Now as far as I'm concerned, option number two is obviously the superior choice for several reasons. But I want to point out one very special dynamic that is key to the concept of magnetic sponsoring. Who finds and contacts the other person first is very important here. Now, on option number one, you were chasing the prospect. While on option number two, the prospect was basically chasing you, which means you were perceived as the expert and hold all of the power and value in that situation. Now, the prospect basically invited you into his world and is asking you to sell him your goods or services. You get to instantly bypass all of the barriers and walls that must be broken down by everybody else. And all of a sudden, this isn't about selling anymore. You're now in the position of a knowledgeable service provider whose expertise has really been sought out and pursued. Now, this is where you have to be in today's marketplace in order to break through the infinite noise that's out there. So how do you do it, right? Well, it's simple. The most potent marketing method, the most potent marketing weapon, you could even put it that way, you have in your arsenal is actually you. Because unlike all of the other business opportunities out there, there's only one of you in the entire world. And what we teach in Magnetic Sponsoring is how to use attraction marketing strategies to become that person, that leader and that expert that everyone wants to work with, that person whose phone calls and emails are welcomed and valued instead of detested and deleted. And you can be that person. I've been studying human psychology for several years now, and what might surprise you is that attraction between people isn't really a choice. It's a biological response. And if we learn how to flip these attraction switches on within ourselves, we automatically begin to attract other people. Now, two of the most important triggers in existence are called value and status. Now, if you can establish a relationship with a person of greater status or value, your personal value and status automatically increases well through that association alone. New doors open 
Opportunities are found that have never been found before. New inside knowledge can be gained that's really only reserved for people within a small inner circle. New alliances can be formed, new partnerships can be found with other powerful people that you would never otherwise have access to. Now, this is why you are on training calls every week to gain insights from successful team leaders. This is why you idolize, I know I did, the top distributors on stage at your company events and crowd around them afterwards to listen in on their conversations. This is why you stand and cheer for your company's CEO when he gets on stage and speaks. These people have something of value to offer you, and by associating with them, you have power to gain as well. Now, we've been programmed this way from the very beginning, and if you struggle with sponsoring in this industry now, you know why, hopefully. I used to think that sponsoring was just about numbers, that it was about scripts and saying the right words. But no matter what I did, I continued to struggle to build a team of distributors for over five years. And until I realized the difference between myself and the leaders in my company who were sponsoring dozens of new reps every single month, I continued to struggle. And they were different because they held value in the eyes of their prospects. They knew how to convey that value in that marketing. And when their prospects saw this, they were attracted to these individuals. They wanted to work with them. And it was really a privilege to be sponsored by them because they knew that there was power and knowledge to be gained in such a relationship. So where does that leave you? It's a very interesting question. And if you're not sponsoring new distributors, if prospects don't return your phone calls or respond to your emails because you simply don't hold any value in their eyes, you have nothing to offer them yet. And that's okay. Everyone starts from square one. But if you want to achieve the highest levels of success found in this industry, you need to change that. And the best way to do that is to increase your value to others, especially in this industry. The easiest way to go do that is to increase your knowledge level. That's what I did. I spent a year buying every course I could on online marketing, copywriting, and personal development. And by the end of that year, I had so much to offer my prospects that sponsoring literally became effortless. So as we continue through this series, always remember that if you want to make the sponsoring process as easy as possible, you need to increase your value to your prospects by increasing your level of knowledge and experience. Buy every book you can, buy every course you can, because every time you do, you're going to gain knowledge and skills that are extremely valuable and attractive to your prospects. Now, this has nothing to do with technological gadgets like auto-dialers, scripts, or lead lists. And I want to make that very clear to everyone. I could give you all of those things right now, but if you didn't hold any personal value in the eyes of your prospects, you would still find yourself struggling to build a team and acquire customers. And that actually leads me to the second piece of a very large puzzle here. Now, there's an old marketing cliche I came across two years ago. These two sentences played a critical role in the development of my business and really allowed me to go from waiting tables to seven figures in less than two years, and they are absolutely crucial to marketing your opportunity and products successfully in today's marketplace. So here are those two sentences for you.